Bach Room 227, the Biomaterials Lab, houses a 150KN Instron tinsel tester and an Instron torsional tester. Students learn how to operate and program the tinsel tester. The tinsel tester contains both manual and pneumatic grips along with heads for tension and compression. Testing has been conducted on synthetic materials including the characterization of metals and polymers and on natural based materials. Students are acquainted with the equipment in the Introduction to Biomaterials course and utilized extensively during the Senior Biomedical Engineering Design course series. The torsional tester is also utilized in the Introduction to Biomaterials course to investigate torsional properties. A portion of the Biomaterials lab is designated for open student design space. The lab contains six open tables for student project work and collaboration. In addition, the lab contains three electronic slash circuit stations of open work. Each electronic station includes a Keysight waveform generator, Keysight digital multimeter, protoboards, and two-channel Tektronix digital oscilloscope. In addition to the electronic stations, the lab contains a fourth table with a computer for student usage and an additional table with a soldering station. The xerography cutter is used to fabricate two-dimensional shapes from thin plastic materials. Each two-dimensional shape can be stacked layer by layer to form a three-dimensional construct. Students use the cutter to create microfluidic devices for the BME research techniques and BioMEMS courses. BioMEMS is a special topics course in biomedical engineering. The microfluidic devices are used to demonstrate fluid transport principles in microchannels. The wax printer is used to deposit solid wax onto chromatography paper for the fabrication of paper-based assays. After printing, these assays are heated at 80 degrees Celsius for about 3 to 5 minutes to allow the wax to melt through the thickness of the paper. We hope to see you on campus soon to tour the Biomaterials Lab in person. Click on these video tours of some of our other labs in the Biomedical Engineering Department.